Good afternoon, class. Hi. Hi, good afternoon. How good are you? Good afternoon. How are you? Well, fine. fine. Yeah? Okay, good. Um, I'm glad to hear that. How how was your day? Did you have a good day today? Yes, I slept. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's that's yeah. definitely good. <laughs> yeah. That's, yeah, that's very positive. Any time that you can you can sleep, that's great. Excellent. Yeah. Uh, okay. teacher, mm -hmm. uh, I have a meeting at five. I need to disconnect to four thirty because oh. I need to take a bus <laughs> and the noisy. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Um, let's do something. Uh, continue connected. Okay, continue connected um, until the very end, even if you don't have, you are not able to open your camera. Uh, okay. Okay? okay. Okay. All right. Okay, good, good. Uh, wondering what the other, what happened to the other people? Hmm. Okay, yeah. Okay, I'm going to send a message to everybody in the group so that they can connect. Okay, hopefully they will remember to connect because, um, yeah, okay, so, all right, guys, um, well, thank you very much. I appreciate um, that you two were um, connected, that you connected on time. Um, whenever you, you um, are in class, it really, um, tells us that you are that you're really dedicated to learning so that's very good so thank you for connecting on time everybody okay um okay let's see um by the way how was how was your day uh fatima okay can you repeat how was your day? Yeah. I, yes. I when I go out to my work, I uh -huh. sleep. You you oh. discon you disconnected completely. Yes. <laughs> good. Good. So did you do anything else other than sleeping, or just just stayed at home and slept? Yes. Only stay at home. Okay. Okay. Well, that's good. Uh -huh. That, that that's fair too. What about you, Jose? Alberto, did you do anything um today or anything interesting? Uh, I day free sleeping in the morning. <laughs> you too? You too are sleeping. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. So what what time do you do? What time do you finish work? Uh seven I am. Ah, okay. So you finish seven a.m. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then you get home around what time? Uh, nine, nine. At nine. At nine. Both. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So I I understand. Yeah. It's um. It's long. Yeah. So you wake. You go to. You you go home at nine. And you go to sleep maybe at nine thirty, something like that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. So. I sleep in two, two hours, three hours. Really? Then you wake up and eat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I get it. I get it. It. Yeah, you're right. It it happens. Okay. All right, guys. Um. So. Um. I'm going to take attendance right now.
because um, unfortunately I don't see anybody else connecting. So I'm going to have to um, start with the with the with the lesson, okay? Or better said, with the PowerPoint. Sorry, with the the attendance. Sorry, with the attendance. Okay, so we'll start with um, Alicia. No, right? Eh, so Alicia Beatriz, no. Um, Ana Cristina, no. Uh, Christian David Melendez. Okay. Uh, Fatima Roxana Rivera. Present. All right, wonderful. Um, Hacy Yesenia Monroy. Hacy Yesenia Monroy. Okay. Uh, yes, uh, Jennifer Carolina Hernandez. Um, Jose Alberto Ran Orantes. Present. Great. Jose de, uh, Kevin Rivera. Um, Jose David. Juan Carlos Padilla. Karen Liliana Aquino. Catherine Yvonne Palacios. Reina Noemi Palacios. Eh, Vanessa Elizabeth Quintanilla, Violeta Gerardina Mejía, and Yusena Elizabeth López. Vi a alguien que se conectó y ya después se desconectó. No vieron quién era. No. No. Okay, sí se conectó alguien, pero no, no logré ver, ver quién, quién era. No, pero no logré ver bien quién era. Okay. All right, guys. Um, so we're going to start. Um, second. Okay. Well, um, <clears throat> eh, primeramente, com, uh, ¿cómo vamos con la plataforma? ¿Ya la terminamos? No, me falta, no. Un, me falta un poco. Me falta un poco. Ok, eh, ¿cuánto? Voy al 67% ahorita, algo así. Tengo que terminar ahora. Ok, va al 67%, dice. Aproximadamente, sí. Ok, ok. Um, hmm, ok, entonces, um, significa que entonces le hace falta la unidad... ¿Cuatro y cinco? ¿Las dos? No, eh, el, el examen final. Voy ah, son las... Ah, ok, ok. Entonces, la, la sección uno, dos, tres, cuatro y cinco ya la terminó. Solamente ajá. le hace falta el examen final, ¿es correcto? Ajá, ajá, sí. ¿Sí? Ok, ok, yes. ok. Very good, very good. Okay, um, okay, perfect. Uh, and in su caso, Fatima? Ya, yeah, ya la terminé. Toda la plataforma? Sí, solo ahora voy a chequear porque me había quedado un, en un examen de una respuesta no me aparecía porque no entendía si estaba escribiendo, caminando <laughs> o trabajando. Oh, <laughs> Eh, es una que, que tiene de un como, audio ajá, que tiene que, opción que está haciendo María creo eh, ajá que hay como una opción de, de que está, está um, comprando ah. ¿Sí? una compañera me dijo que typing me dijo que podría ajá. hacer sí, es pero que no es le no he visto. shopping and marketing uh, supermercado es la respuesta. Uh -huh. Sí, es que eso es lo que le iba a decir, de que creo, si no me equivoco, déjeme revisar, si no me equivoco, ¿usted se acuerda que, que, um, qué ejercicio uh -huh. era? Creo que le tomé captura, voy a, porque le pregunté a alguien a ver si uh -huh. era...
Así le puedo, le puedo ayudar con más facilidad. Quizás no. Pero se va a en el examen en el 5.3, no sé si hay 3, creo, 4. Uh -huh. uh -huh. okay. des, decía, se escuchaba lo, el audio y decía que qué está haciendo María. El primero está conduciendo, nadando, uh -huh. pero no, no, no recuerdo bien. El último, el ocho, si no me equivoco, es que me hacía falta. Se oye como que va caminando o trabajando. Ok, déjenme revisar. That, that is the final exam, right? Is that correct? The final exam? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's right. Hmm. ¿Es el examen final? Voy a checar aquí por mi teléfono. Porque hay en el examen. 5.13 es. Al final ah, eh, está comprando. Eso no pero es el examen. No es el no examen es final. Es el, la, la sección 5, porque no la encuentro en el examen final. ¿Es correcto en la, la sección 5? Sí, es en la sección 5. Ah, ok, ok. En la tarea 5. Ok. Déjenme ver. Es la 8. La, la número 8. Okay. 5.3 ¿Eso es lo que dijo? 5.3 5.13 A 13 13 En la octava pregunta hey. Ok Sí, ok, ajá, sí, sí, sí. O sea, we're talking about this one, right? Yes. I, uh, yo escribí shopping. Yes, it no. is. This one, right? Yeah, yeah. So the last one, eh, ella está, eh, ajá, está, es, eh, escribiendo a, a, ¿cómo se llama? A máquina. Está escribiendo máquina. ¿Ok? Entonces, solo tiene que poner eso en inglés. ¿Ok? So, ah, okay. this one. What's Mary doing this one? Uh -huh. Tiene que poner que está, que está escribiendo máquina. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Any questions? Okay. Uh, <clears throat> okay. So, um, 
So, okay, so we're going to start with their class. Um, please tell me if you can see the PowerPoint. Yes. Yes. Okay, so this is a beginner one, Hans Brands. It's day number eight. The date is Saturday, May 20th, 2023. And your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. Okay, so um, just a reminder for useful language, if the teacher asks any questions, you can say, excuse me, can you repeat that please? Or can you repeat that? Can you speak more slowly? How do you spell? What's the answer for number four? How do you say mm, in English? And what does da -da -da mean? Okay, and how do you pronounce this word. Okay, so those are some of the um, uh, what the things that you can use. Oh, creo que nos perdimos a. Bueno, okay. Um, okay. So, uh, una pregunta. No me acuerdo muy bien. Terminamos hacer es, este ejercicio la vez pasada. No me acuerdo muy bien. Solo terminamos uno. Creo que solo tres hicimos. Pero es lo primero, dos. Ok, ok, good. So, um, déjenme ver. ¿Qué habrá pasado ahí con nuestro compañero? Hmm. Ah, creo que ya se está otra vez conectando. Hello, hola, hello, José. Hello, uh, se me cayó el internet. It's okay, no problem. Okay, um, solo hágame un favor, eh, acuérdese de renombrar ahí eh, en su dispositivo para que le aparezca su nombre completo. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So, um, so, um, eh, Jose, I was asking, did we, I don't remember if we finished this exercise. Do you remember doing this exercise last time? No. No, we didn't do it? Okay, all right. So remember that last time we we talked about how to talk about what people are wearing, right? What are what are people wearing in that moment? So you can say, for example, um, I am wearing uh green or dark green pants, for example. Okay. Okay, we can say she is wearing uh, a bright red dress. Okay, or we can say she is wearing a um, black suit. or they are wearing, um, they're wearing, um, a light green socks, for example. Do you remember that we saw this last class? Can we? Do you, do you remember this? ¿Se acuerdan de esto? Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, we can we can also talk about we, right? So um we can say we are wearing a uh, we are wearing uh dark blue Suits. No, no, sorry. Not suits. Um, dark blue 
sneakers. Okay, do you remember that? Remember this from last class? Yes. yes. Okay, so remember that when we're talking about what people are wearing, we always use the verb to be. So you say, for I, you say am. Actually, just give me a moment. Okay, so for I, you would say I am, right? For um, she, we say she is. For he, he is. For they, they are. For we, we are, right? We always use the verb to be. After that, after that, we're going to be using a, the verb in the ing. So wearing, oh, let me change that color. Let's make it uh, green. Okay, so I am wearing dark green pants. She is wearing a bright uh, red uh, dress. He is wearing a black suit. They are wearing light green socks. We are wearing dark blue sneakers. So we use the verb plus the um, ing, right? That's how we're always going to make it. So wearing, 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 wearing. Do you remember that? Do you remember that or no? Yes. Yeah? Jose Alberto, do you remember that? Yes. Okay. All right, very good. Um, okay, so now also in the negative, let's make it in the negative. So what's the what's the negative of um of I am wearing? Negative? I am not wearing. Exactly. I'm not wearing. I'm just going to put it like that. What's the negative of she? She she's not. She's not. Okay. So we can say, there are two ways to say. You can say she's not wearing. She is not wearing. Yeah. Or you can also say she's she isn't wearing. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, so the two forms are valid. Okay. So she she's not and then wearing, for example, or she isn't wearing two forms. Okay. What's the negative for he is wearing a black suit? He's not. He, he's not. Very good. Or he, or he isn't. Isn't. Yeah, exactly. He isn't wearing. Okay. All right. Uh, what's the negative of they? They, they are not. not. Very good. Excellent. They're, I'm sorry. They're not wearing or, or are not, aren't, aren't, yeah, aren't wearing. Okay. So the two forms are possible. Okay. And the last one. Uh, we, we are not. We, we are, are not. We are not. We're not. We're not. Or. 
or what's the negative what, what's the contraction of are not what's the contraction of are not are not contracted is the same as they ¿Cómo se contraen are not? Oh. Lo mismo de they. Aren't. Aren't, exactly. Uh. Okay. So the two forms are valid. Okay. Okay. Any questions about this? Do you have any questions? No. Oh. No? Okay. Right. This is just like a review of what we saw last class. And I'm doing a review because I know it was a long time ago. Sé que, que ya tenemos más de una, bueno, tenemos una semana de haber tenido esta clase. Entonces, por eso que quería um, hacer un repaso. Okay. But this is just, it's a review, un repaso. Okay, all right, so what we're gonna do is we're going to complete these sentences with um, the information from the picture. For example, my name's Claire, I'm wearing a green suit today. And then you over here, you're gonna have to write the answers. I think we did this together, but we're gonna just remember, okay, so. Um, so we say, um, so in this case, I wearing, okay, so I'm wearing high heels, I'm wearing, sorry, yeah, I'm wearing high heels, I'm wearing high heels, okay, that would be the, the answer for this one here. Then it says, uh, it's raining, but I'm not wearing. Very good. I'm not wearing. I'm not wearing a raincoat. Okay. Because you could see she's not wearing a raincoat, but she's wearing heels. Okay. So what you're going to do is complete this, the answers for number two. And also for number three, oops, sorry. For number, oops, ay, perdón. Se me cambia. Okay, for number three and number four as well. Okay, so I'm going to send this to you uh, through the WhatsApp group. Okay, hello, Katrin, welcome. Katrin Vaughn, are you there? Hello. Hello, welcome, welcome to the class. How are yeah, you? you? I'm fine, and you? Good, thank you. Uh, I'm, I'm... Me dormí. Ah, uh, sí, entiendo, no se preocupe, pero me alegro mucho. De... ¿Cómo? Me, me costó entrarle. Oh, sí, sí, sí. Pero le agradecemos mucho de que se haya conectado, aunque sea un poquito más tarde, pero se conectó y eso es lo más importante. Ok. Thank you. Así que ya. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, no, absolutely. Ok. Eh, vamos. Bueno, um, los voy a mandar ahorita a Breakout Rooms. Ok, mientras que, y, y ya cuando lleguen al breakout room, esperemos de que ya llegue la, la imagen y puedan trabajar en eso. Ok. Ok. okay. ok, I'm going to send you right now to that group.
José Alberto. José Alberto no puede entrar. José Alberto. No sé si me logra escuchar. Está teniendo problemas para entrar. No tengo el agua en el teléfono. Al WhatsApp ¿Eh? mandó la imagen. Okay. The number two, right? Good day, This uh, it's hot today. Toshi and Noriko. Uh, they wearing shorts and t-shirts. What do you think? Sería day, ¿verdad? Day, sí. Day. Yeah, they it's very soon, but they they are not wearing sunglasses. But they they are The number three. Phil. Phil. Phil, Phil is wearing a suit today. Where? And the, he he's wearing pants and and a jacket. He's wearing a brown t-shirt, but he's not he's not wearing a tie. No sé si me entienden. <laughs> sí. Bájale. For she, she's not a wearing shirt. Quiero en el for. It's cool today with Kelly. I can say, yeah. Hi. What do you think in this? A coat is abrigo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's cold today, but Kate, it's not wearing a coat. Coat. 
Come on, where are you? She's, she's, um, she's wearing a sweet shirt. She's not uh, wearing a sneaker. No, we have one before. She's not wearing a boot. Boot. Teacher, it's boots 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 right boots boots uh -huh. yeah boots. boots she's not wearing a boot she's wearing a sneakers good just remember that she's not wearing boots in she's not wearing boots not a boots but she's not wearing boots because uh, boots is two e a is for one this is you know it's a boots Es como decir un botas. Ella está usando un botas. No, so we can't say that because botas are two. Okay? Are we finished? Yes. Yeah, you're finished? Yes. Okay, perfect. I'll see you in the main room. Hello, Juan Carlos. Welcome, Juan Carlos. Um, eh, you, can you turn the, the camera around? Because right now we cannot see you. I see. Okay, good. Excellent. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, hi, teacher. Good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. I'm sorry for come later. A little late. <laughs> yeah yeah it's okay it's okay no worries um it's good that you were able to connect gracias ahí por conectarse sé que a veces cuesta ahí con con los horarios verdad pero le agradezco mucho de que haya hecho ese esfuerzo de conectarse aunque sea un poco tarde okay eh, sí, lo siento eh, me acosté a la ahorita como a las dos Mm. Es lo, de las dos hasta ahorita es lo único que he dormido porque eh, wow. me tocó venir del trabajo y comenzar a, con el delivery eh, hasta la una sin parar, entonces este, dije, dormiré un, un poquito y se me pasó la mano no sí. sé si la alarma entiendo, no se preocupe que, okay. que a veces pasa, entiendo Pero gracias ahí por hacer el, el esfuerzo de conectarse. Okay. Gracias. Okay, so we're going to check the answers. Please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. Yes, I can see. Okay. All right, so we we did the first one together. So um, just just to make sure that we and we remember, I'll write down the answers. I'm wearing right, and here it's I'm not wearing right. Right. Okay. So those are the answers that we already talked about together. Now look at this. Um, it's hot today. Toshi and Noriko. 
we are wearing? Um, it's not we because okay. we're talking about two people. Um, so we're talking about yeah. so they are right. They, they are wearing. Excellent. Okay, they are wearing. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Now the only thing is that we can't exactly say they are wearing because we already have a subject. The subject is Toshi and Oriko. So we cannot say Toshi and Oriko, they are wearing. It's like, it's like if I said, um, Juan Carlos, he is wearing uh, a white shirt, a t-shirt. I can't say that, like in Spanish. Eh, no puedo decir, Juan Carlos, él está, eh, está eh, llevando puesto un, uh, mm, una camiseta blanca. Yeah. yeah. So what are we going to mm. say? Yeah. So, so what's the answer? And Noriko are wearing. Exactly. Yeah. Very yeah. good. I'm Very. sorry, I am asleep. Oh, no, no, it's okay. It's okay. No problem. Yeah. No, 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 no worries at all. We're just, we're learning here. So that's good. This happens. I, actually, this happens very often that students do this. So it's good that we are addressing that. So we always, if we have the name of a person, we eliminate the, the other yeah. subject, right? So we don't, we don't have to repeat the subject. Good. Okay. Um, next, you guys can help me, anybody? It's very sunny, but they? But they? But they aren't. 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 Are not or aren't, the, the two of them are. Okay. Aren't what? Aren't wearing. wearing. Yeah, good. Wearing. They aren't wearing. Okay, so the two forms are valid. Are not wearing or aren't wearing, or they're wearing, they're not wearing. Uh, so this is an, so this one possibility. Another possibility is this. Okay. That's okay. another another possibility. Okay. Any questions at this moment? No question. No. Okay. All right. Let's clear it and let's uh, talk about the other one. So, <clears throat> Phil. Phil. A suit today. What's the answer? Fatima? Phil is wearing a suit today. Good. Phil is wearing, or we can also say Phil's wearing. Yes. Okay, so the two forms are okay. Phil is wearing or Phil's wearing. Okay. Next. Um, okay. Jose Alberto, can you help me with the next one? He? He's not wearing. Okay, he is not wearing, or also, actually, no, he no, he is not, or he is. He's. He is. He's yeah, very good. So he is, or he's wearing. The two forms are possible. Okay. He's wearing. Okay. He's wearing pants and a jacket because you can see, the pants. And the jacket is here. Remember, jacket in Spanish, sorry, in English is like in Spanish, um, it could be chaqueta or saco. Okay, okay, so the two. Okay. Next. Yes. Wearing. Okay. He is wearing. Very good. So he yes. is wearing or contracted. He's wearing a brown shirt, okay? And Katherine, can you help me with the last one? But? He 
isn't wearing. Good. He isn't wearing. wearing a tie. Or also possible to say he's not wearing. The two forms oh. are are the two forms are okay. Okay. Okay? Not wearing. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Very good. Um, okay, so let's go to the next one. It's cold today, but Kathy? He is not wearing. Kathy? He is not? No. He? No, she is. Okay, so she? She is not wearing. Like that? It's like that? I see? No. No. No? Why? No. Why not? Uh, because uh, talking about uh, the person uh -huh. will, will no need to mm -hmm. use the pronouns. Right. Because I, 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 I say the, the name. Right, exactly. We already have the name Kathy, the name of the woman. We know it's a woman, so we don't need to put she again. Okay? So we can just say she's not wearing a coat. Okay? Sorry, yeah. Kath, so Kathy's not wearing a coat. Or, or we can say... Another possibility is saying isn't. She isn't wearing a coat. Okay. So the two, Kathy isn't wearing a coat. So the two forms are okay, are possible. Okay. Is that clear for everybody? Yes. Yes. Yeah? yes. So Kathy isn't wearing. We don't need to put she. Okay. Good. Um, Catherine, can you help me with the next one? She's, She's wearing. Okay. She is wearing. Good. She is wearing a sweatshirt. A shirt. Or she is wearing a sweatshirt that is. Gloves and a hat. Very good. The last one, Jose Alberto, can you help me with the last? Well, for the second to last. She's in the... She's wearing? She's wearing? Mm -hmm. She's wearing like that? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, so she's wearing boots? Do you, do you see do you see boots on her? No, she because she wearing uh, boots. Yeah. Uh. No, uh, she is no. in boots. Okay, yeah. So this one's negative, right? So it's not wearing. right. Very good. So we can say she's not wearing or. Or we can say she isn't wearing. Isn't wearing. Yeah, the two forms are possible. Okay. 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 And finally, the last one. Who can help me with the last one? Is wearing. Is okay. wearing. Okay. Is wearing. Or the, the contraction she's wearing. Yeah. Okay. All right. Any questions? No, any questions? No, no questions? No. No? Okay. <laughs> Okay, perfect. All right, now let's discuss um, questions. Questions about what people are doing and wearing, okay? Or better so what people are wearing. So um, here we have the, the same pictures, 
okay, the four pictures. I want you to discuss these questions with a partner, okay? So I'm going to be um, uh, putting you in breakout rooms and you're gonna be asking the questions. Is Claire wearing a green suit? Is she wearing a raincoat? Is she wearing high heels? Are Toby, sorry, sorry, are Toshi and Oriko wearing swimsuits? Are they wearing shorts? Are they wearing sunglasses? Is Phil wearing gray pants? Is he wearing a brown shirt? Is he wearing a tie? Is Kathy wearing boots? Is she wearing a coat? Is she wearing a hat and gloves? So those are the questions. Now, how do you answer? If somebody asks you these questions, how do you answer? Well, there are six ways that you could, or six possible answers for these questions. The first way is to answer, yes, she is. Okay. Or negative. What's the negative? No, she isn't. No, she isn't, exactly. Okay. So that's those are the one way. Another way you can answer if it's a man, you can say, no, he is. Oh, sorry, sorry, my mistake. Yes, he is. Or or no he isn't no he isn't okay so that's another way that another possible answer for these questions and the last way is if they're asking about they you can say yes they are are good or no, no, they are. No, they aren't. Aren't. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So those are the different ways that you can answer these questions. Any questions at this moment? No. No. Perfect. No. Okay. No. So I'm going to send you. Um, okay, um, I think the best way to do this is to send you the, um, the PowerPoint. Okay, here it is. Okay, so I'm going to put you into breakout rooms. Eh, Jose Alberto and Fatima, are you there? Okay, Fatima. Yes, I am here. Okay. <laughs> Wonderful, okay. Es que no la vemos eh, eh, en la cámara, por eso le preguntaba. Okay. Oh, there you are. Okay, great. Es que a, a veces también um, eh, sucede cuando, eh, por ejemplo, estamos en el dispositivo móvil y nos vamos a una otra aplicación fuera de Zoom, se apaga la cámara de Zoom. Entonces, solo acordarles eso de que cuando regresen ahí a Zoom, nuevamente encienden su cámara. Okay. Okay, so... Um, Okay, I'm going to open the rooms and you're gonna, you're going to discuss these questions. Here we go. Not the same one. Sí, pero gracias a Dios que nos conectamos. Cabal, ahí estamos. ¿Verdad que vamos a responder las preguntas? ¿Sí o no, verdad? Ajá, correcto. Así es. 
Voy con la primera. Is Clarice wearing a green suit? Clarice lleva un, un pu puesto, un traje verde, dice. Va. Ajá, así es. Y quiero ver. Yes, va. Yes, she is, sería, va. Uh -huh. uh -huh, yes, correcto. She... La segunda. Is she wearing a raincoat? Lleva un impermeable. Eh, ajá, un, un como se ¿Cómo? Abrigo, ¿Cómo abrigo para el agua, ajá, algo así, ajá. Quiero ver, como algo la que se ha puesto arriba de la cabeza. No. Como por ejemplo sería eh, no sé cómo se le llama acá, cuando uno se pone eh, en vez de usar el paraguas, uno utiliza una como chumpa, ya sea de plástico o de o, o algo contra el agua. Ah. Ya. Entonces sería también yes she is. No, no, porque... no porque no es eso. Ajá, no, no es eso, ajá. No es eso. Esa es la cartera o el. Ajá, como que es algo. Algo que como el. Que es un maletín, va. Ajá, como un maletín que ella usa, ajá. ajá. Cabal, entonces no es el raincoat. Ah, vale. Uh -huh. Pues sería no, she is. Correcto. Is the she wearing high heels? Heels, ¿qué heels? No sé, fíjese. Tendríamos Pero... que buscarlo. Ahorita aquí lo voy a buscar. Ok. Ah, lleva tacones altos, dice. Ah, high heels. Uh -huh, ok. Is Phil wearing... Is Phil wearing gray pants? No. No. No, he's... He's not. Uh -huh. Oh, he's... Oh, he isn't. No, no, he's not. Oh, ah, también. No, he isn't. He's not. He's not. He's not. Ah, acaba. Eh, eh, is he wearing a brown shirt? Yes, no. he, yes he is. Yeah. Camisa, eh, camiseta café, dice. La ocho. Bueno, no, ah, sí. Pues sería yes. La nueve es Thai, ¿qué significa Thai? Corbata. Y alcanza a ver, yo en el dispositivo lo tengo. No va. No, no, he's no. No, he's no. He isn't. La 10 es Katy wearing boots. No, she's not. Is she wearing a coat? Coat? No. ¿Qué es coat? Como saco, abrigo. No, sería no. Yeah. Is she wearing a hot hot no hot como dice el sombre gorro hot hot and gloves and yes yes she is ahí estamos solo esa sombra mm -hmm. bueno
estamos. All right, guys, very good. So um, we are going to check the answers. <clears throat> okay, is Claire wearing a green suit? What's the answer? No. Yes, she is. Yes, she is? Yes. Do you all agree? Yes, she is? Yes, I agree. Okay. All right, very good. Yeah. Is she wearing a raincoat? Is she wearing a raincoat? No, she's not. No, she's not. Do you agree? No, she's yes, not? No, uh, no. Very good. She is not wearing a raincoat. So, no, she is not. Yeah. Okay, very good. Um, all right, next. Is she wearing high heels? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Um, yes. Very good. Yes, she is. Very good. Are Toshi and Oriko wearing swimsuits? No, they are, aren't. Mama, I agree. Do you agree? Yeah. Yeah. Very yes. good. Okay. So Toshi and Oriko are not wearing swimsuits. Are they wearing shorts? Yes, they yeah. are. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes, they are. Um, are they wearing sunglasses? No, they are not. No, they aren't. No, they aren't. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, they aren't. Is Phil wearing? Oops, pardon. Is Phil wearing a uh, gray pants? Is Phil wearing gray pants? This is Phil. Is he wearing gray pants? No, he's not. No, he's not? Is, is Phil wearing gray pants? Yes or no? He's wearing gray pants. Oh, I'm, I'm not sure the colors. Okay. Mm -hmm. What is gray? What is, what is gray? Gris. Gris. Okay, so is he wearing gray pants? No, he isn't. Mm, yes, he is. Uh, uh, um, I agree with, with, um, with my partner. Uh, uh -huh. The color... Uh, uh, it's not even clear. <laughs> yeah, I I seen so that the pants is a. Uh, it's a little brown. <laughs> dark, dark green. Dark. Oh, <laughs> you say you say that it's dark green, and she says that it's brown. Oh my goodness. Um. Yeah. yeah um, no. Mm -hmm. um, because that. Reason uh, the answer is um, different. Mm. Okay. Yeah. 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 I think they are gray. They're supposed to be gray. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Very good. Um, and then uh, he's. Uh, yeah. Yes, he is. Uh, okay. Okay. Very good. Um, is he wearing a brown shirt? Is he wearing a brown shirt? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. 
Um, yeah, yes, he is. Very good. Is he wearing a tie? No, he isn't. No, he isn't. I agree with the... No, he isn't. That's right. No, he isn't. Um, is Kathy wearing boots? No, she's not. No, she's not. No, she's not. Mm -hmm. no, she's not. Very good. No, she is not. Or no, she isn't. The two forms are okay. Okay. Um, is she wearing a coat? Is she wearing a coat? <clears throat> <clears throat> no, she's not. No, she's not. Very good. No, she isn't. Okay, good. And is she wearing a hat and gloves? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Very good. Any questions? No. No. No? It's all clear? Okay, perfect. Okay, very good. Um, all right, let's talk about these time zones. When we are talking about, okay, so if it, we're going to explain here about time zones, do you understand what are time zones? Yes. Yes, everybody understands time zones? Yeah? Yes. Yeah? Okay. So there are actually 24 time zones in all the world. Okay? Okay. And each time zone, it, it, or better said, each, um, each, section of a time zone has the same time okay so so for example if we're talking about um let's say here these the people that live in this part here have the same time zone okay mm -hmm. now the people that live here and here they have the same time zone and so on, okay? So for example, uh, let's say, let's talk about, um, let's talk about uh, Canada, okay? So Canada is all of this part here. Okay, so all of this part here is Canada. Okay, all of this. Now, what happens is if you notice, Canada has different time zones. Okay, so even though it's only one country, but it's divided into many time zones. So you will notice that this is the first time zone. Okay, then we have another time zone which is right here, the part that is in white. Okay. Then we have another time zone, which is the part that is in blue. So all the part here that is in blue is another time zone. And the last one is the part that is, actually, no, sorry, they had five, sorry. There's another one here that is in white, okay. And finally, there is this part here that is, um, it's actually like in, like a gray color, okay? Um, okay. Um, hello, Alicia, welcome. Hello. Okay. Perdón por llegar tarde. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you for connecting. 
tuve un inconveniente, pero aquí estamos ready. Excellent. Hey, I like that. <laughs> La felicidad. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we have here four, sorry, five time zones. One, two, three, four, five. So Canada has five time zones. That means, so is, is that clear for everybody? Do you see the different time zones? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay. All right, good. So, um, so if, for example, somebody is in Vancouver, okay, in, so they are here in Vancouver, and let's say that in Vancouver, it's 12, okay? Let's say that right now in Vancouver, it's 12. Okay. Let's say it's 12 p.m. Okay. What time is it in Montreal? Well, Vancouver is in this time zone, and then you have to count how many differences of time uh, of, of um, time zones there are. So, for example, here is, is Vancouver right there, okay? And then we're going to count one time zone, then we have another time zone, that's two time zones. Then we have three time zones. And then finally, we have the last one, five time zones. But Montreal is actually in this time zone. So the difference is, the difference is one, two, three, three hours of difference. So what time is it in Montreal? <laughs> if in four Canada, hours? If it's 9 p.m. Mm, okay, it, so in Vancouver, it's 12 p.m. Okay. And Vancouver is here. Now, in this time zone, there is one hour difference. Yeah, 11. Here, it's two hours difference. And Montreal uh, okay. is here in this Nine. one, three hours difference. Nine. So what time is it in Montreal? 8 p.m. Um, no, because it's going no. forward. It's going forward. Um, so if it's 12 p.m. and we add three hours, what time is it in Montreal? No. Two, three, four. Four I am. It's night. Mm -hmm. So we're we're going to add four hours. Okay. Right? Four hours. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Three hours. Sorry. Three hours. Because the time difference is between three hours. One, two, it's, three. It's so, three p.m. Exactly. Very good. It's going to be then three p.m. Do you see that? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Because there is, we're starting here, right? Este no cuenta. Esta parte de acá no cuenta porque aquí es donde empezamos. Right here. So we just count. One, two, three. So three hours. So we get to 3 p.m. Okay? Uh, okay. I'm going to show you another one. Okay, El Salvador. El Salvador is right here, right? Okay, that's El Salvador. Yeah. So what's, what time, so let's say that, in what time is it right now in El Salvador? 2 p.m. Okay. About, uh, 2 p.m. Right now? Um, one, one, two. Okay, but uh, yeah, Four. Right. no, no, no. You're you're right. You're right. You're absolutely right. Yeah, yeah. Entendí lo que quiere decir. Yes, according to this, according to uh -huh, this, yeah. yes, exactly. You're you're yeah. absolutely right, because we are in this time zone. 
where we continue in this time zone right here, right? So if if a twelve if it's twelve o'clock in Vancouver, we just have to add two hours. Okay. So what yes, time is it? Yes. What time is it in 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 El Salvador? If it's 12 p.m. in Vancouver, ¿qué hora es? Uh, if 2 p.m. If I, mm -hmm. I take the ref reference uh, Vancouver. Exactly. It's 2 okay. p.m. Yeah. Okay? Because the difference between Vancouver and El Salvador is two time zones. One, two. That's the okay. difference. Yes. Yeah? Do we understand? Yes. Yes, Fatima, it's okay. It's clear? Yes. Yeah? Okay. So, uh, Alicia, it's clear? Yes, es la diferencia que tiene los países de horario, ¿verdad? Yeah. Si me equivoco. Yes, okay. exactly. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, there's two hours difference between Vancouver and and El Salvador, okay? Because Vancouver is here. But para que no, no se me pierdan aquí. Vancouver is here. Oops. Let's change it. Vancouver is here. Okay. And El Salvador is somewhere here. So there are two time zones difference. Okay. Now if it's 2 p.m. in El Salvador, what time is it in Sao Paulo? What time is it in Sao Paulo? Three. Sure. So to know, to know Three, we have four. to count. We have to count. Five. Five, so, five p.m. Mm -hmm. So here, this is one time zone. That's one time zone. The other okay. one uh -huh. is two. two. Over Three, here, four, two. Five. And then five here. PM. Yeah. Then we five have PM. over here. Three. Three. So that means that we have to add three hours. It's five PM. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be? So what time in Sao Paulo? Five. Yes, very good. It's going to be 5 p.m. Because there are there are three time zone differences between El Salvador and Sao Paulo. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. Very good. Very, very good. Okay. Now what? Okay, I'm gonna clear this. Now, what cities have the same time zone? Can you tell me which cities are the same? Same time zone? Uh, can you repeat again, please? Um, what, what cities uh -huh. have are in uh -huh. the same time zone? Vancouver and Los Angeles. Excellent, yes. Vancouver and Los Angeles are in the same time zone. Yeah, okay. another is Montreal and New York City. Good, Montreal and New York City. Very good. Another one? What's Brasilia, Sao Paulo. Very good, Brasilia and Sao Paulo. They are in the same. Very good. Actually, if you noticed, also eh, Lima is in the same time zone as Montreal in New, New York City. Yeah? Okay? Okay. All right, very good. Um, okay, good. So, what other what other cities are in the same time zone as San Salvador? What other cities? And not necessarily from here, but 
in general have, with other cities are in your same time zone? Not, not necessarily from here, just in general, what you know, what other cities? <clears throat> So we're here, right? El Salvador is right here. So what city what cities are in the same time zone? Moscow? I'm I'm not sure. As El Salvador? Um, uh, Guatemala. Guatemala uh, City. Very good. Yeah. Guatemala City. What else? Mm -hmm. um, um, one part uh, Mexico yes very good uh, Mex uh, Mexico the City least, the least Honduras the mm -hmm. yeah but cities yeah. cities not countries cities uh, Belmopan huh? Belmopan in Belize okay the Belmopan same. very good okay what else what other ones which other ones? Uh -huh. Panama City. Is Panama City in the same time zone? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yeah, excellent. Okay, very, very good. Okay, now um what about in europe what what's what cities are a are over here what cities are in the same time zone what cities are in the same time zone uh -huh. What cities are in the same time zone? Okay, so I'll help you a little bit. For example, we have London. City. London. New York City. And uh, Casablanca. Sao uh, Paulo. No, no. Yeah. Okay, they're in the same time zone. What are the cities? Warsaw. Warsaw. Warsaw and, and Moscow. on Moscow. Very good. They're in the same time zone too. Excellent. Okay, very good. And what, what about over here? Which ones are in the same time zone? Mm -hmm. Which ones are in the same time zone? Probably, mm, I think they know they're not. Creo que no. Yeah, I think they're different. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Okay, so, Mike, okay, so I have a question for you. Vamos a ver si, si, si logran, vamos a ver si han logrado comprender esto. Vamos a ver. Okay, right now, vamos a, okay, vamos a, Okay, so right now, eh, El Salvador is here. Okay. Okay. So El Salvador is in this time zone, which is here. Okay. Now, you are in El Salvador. I am not in El Salvador right now. Okay, I am not in El Salvador. Okay, ready? I am in another country. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. I am actually, I'll tell you, I'll tell you exactly where I am. Let me tell, let me see where I can. Okay. I am right here. That's where I am. Okay. So this belongs to this time zone. So, what time is it in in El Salvador? Four p.m. Four p.m. Very good. Okay. So in El Salvador right now, it's four p.m. Okay. Vamos a ver si pueden descifrar esto. Actually, okay. it's not four p.m. It's not four p.m. It's four thirty. Right? 4 30. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. So okay. Yeah. So you so you are in El Salvador and it's 4 30 p.m. Okay. What time okay. is it for me? Two and a half. I am. 2.30, yeah. For me, it's 2.30 uh, a.m. Mm -hmm. It's 2.30 a.m. Okay? I, I, I can say uh, two and a half or, or no, not? No, it's 2.30 in the morning. We're going to learn that in a moment. Oh. Okay? Okay. So, ¿han okay. entendido cómo llegamos a esa conclusión, chicos? ¿O no? Okay, ustedes se encuentran ahorita en El Salvador, que está aquí, ¿verdad? Está en este tiempo, esa zona. Yo me encuentro aquí, que está en esta, en esta zona de acá. Entonces, si para ustedes son las cuatro y media, ¿qué hora es para mí? Well, to find the answer, you have to count. You have to count. So, um, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Ten hours of difference. So we have, so you are in El Salvador, I am in, in, in this part of the world, and there are ten hours difference. So if for you it's 4.30, you count 5.30, 6.30, 7.30, 8.30, 9.30, 10.00. Eleven thirty, twelve thirty, one in the morning, two in the morning, or one thirty in the morning, two thirty in the morning. So then you see that for me it's two thirty in the morning. Okay. Oh, see, chicos. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Very very good. Okay. Excellent. Um, let's clear that. And we're now going to talk about, oh, actually, there's this conversation I want you to um, practice with me. Okay, so Debbie, hello. Hello, can you repeat that with me? Hello. 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 Hi, Debbie. Hi, Hi Debbie. Hi, Debbie. This is John. This is John. I'm calling from Australia. I'm, I'm calling from Australia. 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 I'm at a conference in Sydney. I'm at a conference in Sydney. I'm at a conference in Sydney. I'm at the conference in Sydney. Remember? Remember? 
Oh, right. Oh, oh right. right. What time is it there? What, what time, time is it there? It's 10 p.m. It's 10 p.m. 10 p.m. 10 p.m. And it's 4 o'clock there. Yeah, yeah, they're beautiful. And four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? In Los Angeles, Los Angeles right? Right. right? Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Four a.m. Vaya, aquí ponemos oh, 4 a.m. Oh, 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 I'm really sorry. Oh, I'm really sorry. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. I'm awake now. I'm awake. I'm awake. Okay, I can't, I can't see the... The last part. The last part. Okay, don't worry. I'm going to send you this conversation uh, to the to the WhatsApp group, okay, so that you can practice it with a partner. Okay. Um. So just give me a moment. Okay, all right, so right now I'm going to open up the groups so that you can practice with a partner the, the conversation and then switch, okay? You can switch, um, you can switch um, roles, okay? So one time you can, one time you can be um, Debbie, the next time you can be John, okay? Here we go, let's open the rooms. Sí, aquí está ya. El baby, yo soy John. Right. Hello. Hi, baby. This is John. I'm calling from Australia. Australia? I am I'm at, I'm at a conference in Sydney, remember? All right. What time is it there? It's 10 p.m. in four o'clock, there in Los Angeles, right? Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Four I am. Oh, I'm really sorry. Thanks. Okay, I am awake. Okay, no. Bye. Ahora al contrario. Al revés, ¿verdad? Hello. Hi, Debbie. This is John. I, I am calling from Australia. Australia? I am at a conference in Saturday. Remember? Sunday? All right. Remember? All right, what, what time is in here? It's 10 p.m. and it's four o'clock. There is Los Angeles, right? Yes, four o'clock in the morning. For in M.O. I am really sorry. Okay, I'm awake. I'm not awake. No, como se pronuncia ya. Ah, okay. Es que no le veo lo último por la fecha de que me cayó el, el mensaje. No le veo qué dice. Yo creo que dice. Awake. I'm awake. No, dice. Awake no. Awake. Awake. Awake, no. Okay. 
Vaya, no sé. le doy no. otra vez, ¿verdad? Sí. Hello. Hello. Hi, Debbie. This is John. I'm calling from Australia. Australia? I am a conference in Sydney, remember? All right. What time is the it is there? It's 10, 10, 10 p.m. and it's four o'clock here in Los Angeles, right? Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Uh, four I, I am. Oh, I'm really sorry. Thanks. Okay, I awake now. Okay. Vemos una vez más, Carmen, entonces. Bye. Hello. Hi, Debbie. That is John. I am calling from Australia. Australia? I am at a conference in Sunday, remember? All right. What time is it here? It's 10 p.m. and it's 4 o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? Yes, 4 o'clock in the morning. For I am, oh, I am really sorry. Thanks. Okay. I'm awake now. Okay. Okay, very good, everybody. Just a reminder, uh, we pronounce it Australia, not Australia, but Australia. Okay, can you repeat? Australia. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, everybody repeat, oh. Australia. 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 Good. Australia. And, very good. And also we pronounce it uh, Sydney. 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 Yes, very good. Excellent. Okay. Um, and uh, we say awake. 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 Yes, very good. Awake. Okay. All right. Um, okay, so let's let's start. Um, okay, let's let's I'm going to now explain to you guys um how to tell the time. Can you guys see my PowerPoint? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Great. What I'm going to ask you guys to do is um, to um, to uh, what's it called? Um, turn off the microphone. Okay, so if you could turn off your microphones, guys, because I'm going to be explaining. Okay, and I need you guys to um, be uh, be completely focused. Okay, so here we go. So um, I I sent you guys uh, when the the video so that you could see in Spanish. Uh, because it's important that you understand how to tell the time in Spanish to be able to tell the time in English, 
¿ok? So, eh, para poder entender un, un tema bien, tenemos que primero entender ese tema en nuestro propio idioma. Entonces, por eso es que les mandé este video para que lo puedan ver. No sé si lo lograron ver. ¿Alguno de ustedes? Quizás. Sí, sí le ve. Ok, perfecto. Era cortito, duraba menos de cinco minutos. Pero sí, um, solo para recordarles ahí cómo poder um, leer un reloj, ¿verdad? Eh, un... Um, un reloj analógico, porque, um, porque eh, los otros relojes, bueno, estamos como más acostumbrados eh, ellos eh, en el celular y todo, pero esto es como un poquito más, dif más diferente, ¿verdad? So, first of all, let's remember that eh, each time at the clock is five minutes. So here is, we have five, so this is one is five minutes, two is 10 minutes, three, 15 minutes, four, 20 minutes, five is uh, 25 minutes, six, 30 minutes, seven, 35 minutes, eight, 40 minutes, nine, 45 minutes, 10, 50 minutes, 11, 55 minutes, and 12, 60 minutes, right? Okay, so they, that's what they represent. Now, the when the hand, when the hand, um, when the, the big hand, oh, sorry, when the little hand is, let's say, okay, let's say this is the little hand, okay? And the big hand is here. What time is it? Well, let's look at the hour. We say that it's five. Well, it's right on the hour right here. So we say that it's five o'clock. Okay, it's five o'clock. Okay, when it's right on the 12. What does five o'clock mean in Spanish? What is o'clock? Cinco en punto. Cinco en punto. Yeah, very good. La cinco en punto. Okay, so o'clock means in punto. Okay. Cinco en punto. Perdón, no sé si fue mi, cel, mi, mi, mi conexión de internet. Yo creo que sí. ¿Será? No pude escuchar bien. ¿Aló? ¿Me escuchan bien? ¿Hola? ¿Me escuchan? Yes. Yes. Ok, ok. Ok, yo creo que Fátima que se está teniendo problemas ahí para... Ok. Um... Ok. Teacher, so... I need to go out. Oh, ok, ok, no problem. Ok, that's fine. Thank you, thank I... you for letting me know. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok. Um, so... Um, let's let, okay, so the o'clock means en punto, okay? Now, if we move this hand and we move it to, oh, sorry. Yeah, we move it to here, for example. What time is it? Well, basically, there are two ways that you can say this. You can say that it's five, five, ten. Okay, five, ten. So simple as that, five, ten. Okay. Or 
Or we can also say that it's, we can say it's 10 past five. 10 past five. What that means is that it's, there are 10 minutes after the fifth hour. Okay, does that make sense? Five past five, sorry, 10 past five. It's like when you say in Spanish, uh, when you say um, son uh, diez, uh, diez de, uh, pasa a las cinco. Okay? O des, diez después de las cinco. So we're talking about the minutes that go after the hour. Do we understand? Is that clear? Class, is that clear or no? Chicos, pueden encender su micrófonos porque no. Okay. Okay. Is that clear, everybody? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay, very good. The same thing happens if, for example, this... Um, Um, Alicia? Alicia creo que está teniendo problemas para, para con su conexión. Okay. All right. So let's, let's talk about this time right here. Okay. Let's talk about uh, this time. So we have... Alicia, perdón, no, no le escuchamos. Eh, creo que uh, tiene ahí hello. un Hello, hello. Alicia, eh, si, quiere, si, si quiere preguntar algo, decir algo, eh, lo que puede hacer es uh, quitar su cámara y quizás sea mejor conexión así y después abrir el micrófono. Alicia, no sé si. O no sé si soy yo que tengo el problema. ¿Me escuchan bien? Sí, sí, se le escucha bien. Sí. Ok. Sí. Ok. Ok, Alicia. Okay. Ah, sí, es que está teniendo problemas con conexión. Ok. Um, all right, let's, let's continue. So, that is. Um, ok, so that is. A, about five, a five ten. But let's say that we have the the big the big hand is over here in the twenty. So what time is it? Well, um, the time is now going to be five five twenty. Okay, five twenty. But there's another way we can say it. We can say 20 past five, sorry, five, which means 20 minutes after or past five, five the fifth hour. Okay. How do you say that in English? Sorry, in Spanish. How do you say that in Spanish? ¿Cómo se dice eso en español? Las 5 y 20 y en la otra forma serían 20 pasadas las 5. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Las 5 y 20 o 20 pasadas a las 5. O sea, 20 minutos pasadas a las 5. Ok. All right. 
Good. Now, um, yeah, so this is uh, about that. Now, um, when, okay, so basically we can, we can divide the clock into two sections, okay? This section here, oh, sorry. This section here, um, all of the section over here, and I'm just going to make it all messy. All of this section here is when we use the word past, okay? So we're always gonna be using the word past. Five past, 10 past, quarter past, 20 past, 25 past, okay? And then this section over here, All of this section here, this is going to be, oops, this is going to be the section that we're going to be calling the two. Okay. Um, so we say two, 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 two. So this is very similar to the to the video, right? So instead of counting how much it's passed, we're now going to minus, we're going to subtract. So if, for example, the, um, okay. so if, for example, the, um, the, 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 this line here was over here, Okay, on the seven, okay? Then what would happen is that, what would be, what would be the time? It would be 5.35, or we say 25 to six. Because 25 minutes, sorry, 25 minutes, that we need to get to the sixth hour. It's like when you say in Spanish, las 25 menos seis. So, 25 minutos que faltan para que lleguemos a las seis. Do we understand that? Yeah? Dime. Yeah. Okay, now the same thing happens here. If we put, let's say over here, what time is it? If this, this one is here on the 11, what time is it? It would be 5.55, or we can also say, Five, two, six, which means five minutes to the sixth hour. Or like in Spanish, cinco menos seis. Cinco menos las seis. O cinco minutos para las seis. Okay? Is that pretty clear? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay, very good. Now, one thing that you have to take into account is that there are certain words. So just like we have o'clock here, we have half past on the other side. Hi, everyone. In this class, you become so, is So we have um, so we do not say, in English, we do not say uh, five and a half, okay? We never say five and a half. So if this, if the big hand here is over here, and the small hand here, uh, Quieren pueden uh, apagar 
los micrófonos. Todos, thank you. Okay, so if, for example, um, the hand, uh, let's say that this hand here was over here, okay, what time would it be? Well, it would be 5.30, or like you say in Spanish, 5.30, or, Another way that we can say it is five, or oh, sorry, half past five. Or like it's like saying half an hour, la mitad de una hora, okay? Past five, this after, after five. So half of an hour, la mitad de una hora, Past five, which is also the hour. Okay. But we never say five and a half. Nunca decimos cinco y media. La palabra cinco y, o, o la expresión cinco y media, no se puede traducir literalmente five and a half. We can only say 5.30, que son cinco y media, o half past five, que es La mitad de una hora pasada a las cinco. Is that clear? Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. And the last one that I want to teach you is this one. We also use quarter two and quarter past. Okay, so for example, if this hand was over here, what time would it be? Well, it would be 5.15 or a quarter past five, okay? Or like, it's like in Spanish, un cuarto de hora después de las cinco, okay? Quarter of an hour, un cuarto de una hora past five, the fifth hour. Okay. And if this hand was over here, was here, then what time would it be? It would be 5.45, or a quarter to six. So a quarter of an hour, un cuarto de una hora, para a seis. Okay. In theory, we can also say a, a 15 to six. Quince para las seis, in theory. But it's more common to say a quarter. Okay, the same thing here. In theory, you can also say 15, uh, 15 past six. 15 past six. Oh, no, sorry, past six, sorry. 15 past five. Okay. Is that clear for everybody? Okay. Yeah, any questions? Okay. All right. Just two more th two more things I want to teach you before we finish off. That when we have 12 o'clock, 12 o'clock can translate to p.m. or a.m. So if it's 12 
a.m., we call it midnight. Okay. Do we understand midnight? Midnight. Yeah. Do you, do you know midnight? Media noche. Media noche. Media exactly. noche. Exactly. So 12 midnight. Okay. But also 12 o'clock can also mean 12 p.m. When it's 12 p.m., we can say 12 noon or 12 midnight, I'm sorry, midday. Okay, the two are possible. Okay. Okay. Any questions about that? No questions? No. no. Okay. All right, guys. So that is going to be all for today. Um, solo acordarles, chicos, de que necesitamos que terminen la plataforma hoy por la noche. Okay. Um, si ustedes um, tienen alguna pregunta, como siempre les he dicho, escriban en el chat um, del grupo o me escriben directamente a mí y yo voy a tratar de ayudarles lo más que pueda, ¿ok? Pero por favor, indiquen que tienen una, una inquietud. No solamente se la guarden y, y queden así. O sea, les queremos ayudar, pero solamente podemos ayudarles si nos comunican en qué están teniendo inconvenientes, ¿ok? Entonces, okay. Uh, por favor, díganme. Yo con gusto les ayudo, ¿ok? Ahora, eh, la otra cosa es que, que tenemos que tomar asistencia. Así de que me ayuden ahí. Um, here we go. Ok, Alicia Beatriz. Present. Excellent. Um, Ana Cristina Cruz. Ana Cristina Cruz. Eh, Cristian David. Uh, Fatima Roxana. Eh, Rivera. Fatima Roxana Rivera. Ok, very good. Um, Hazy Yesenia Monroy. Jennifer Carolina Hernández. José Alberto Orantes. Present. José Kevin Rivera. Josué David Mejía. Juan Carlos Padilla. Present. Uh, Karen Liliana. Uh, Catherine Yvonne Palacios. Present. Son. Uh, Reina Noemi Palacios. Um, Vanessa Elizabeth Quintanilla. Violeta Gerardina Mejía. Y Yesenia Elizabeth López. Ok. Bueno, chicos, entonces eso sería todo. Uh, para el día de hoy. Um, por favor, manténganse allí en es, uh, pendientes del de el curso uh, siguiente que va a empezar. Entonces, uh, sí, y um, continúen, sigan adelante. Uh, Ustedes lo están haciendo muy bien. Yo sé que es un sacrificio, pero les garantizo que va a valer la pena. Al final, Ustedes van a decir, wow, todo el sacrificio que hice realmente lo, lo agradezco que lo hice cuando pude, ¿verdad? Porque a veces las oportunidades solo se dan una vez y ya después si no las aprovechamos, puede ser que ya no regresen. Entonces, um, hagan esos sacrificios que al final va a valer la pena, les, les garantizo, ¿ok? Así es de que, bueno chicos, ha sido un placer para mí haberlos tenido. Y oh, yeah. estamos ahí, ahí para sí. ayudarles en cualquier cosa. Ok. Ok. Muchas okay. gracias. Gracias, Tiche. Por todo. De nada, de nada. Oh, a mí, yeah. Un placer para mí. Cuídense mucho y que disfruten su fin de semana. Gracias. gracias Bendiciones. Bendiciones. Gracias, realmente.